California game wardens often work alone, patrolling hundreds of miles of wilderness without backup. But sometimes a suspect is so dangerous, an entire squad must come together to take them down. It's 6 a.m. just outside North Highlands, California. An empty parking lot becomes a makeshift command center. The wardens are here to serve a warrant on a dangerous suspect accused of an unthinkable crime. Witnesses told us that they had seen a guy shoot a, a sea lion in the face with a shotgun slug and that they could identify the, the shooter. The suspect told them, you might want to look away if you don't want to see this. The sea lion was eating the fish that he wanted to catch in one of his favorite fishing spots to catch catfish. We're going to park on I, right by 34, stack up there, and we'll go around the corner. Then House is going to be on our left-hand side. Johnson's going to be, you want to be our breach? I'll do breach security. Who's point? You know how many people live at this house? The suspect and then the accomplice's truck has been seen there as well. This is high risk. Both these guys have been arrested for felonies, OK? Full tilt, high risk. We know there's guns. I would probably plan on dope as well. We have shots fired. Obviously, put out what it's for. Preparing for the worst, the wardens roll out to the suspect's house in force. When they arrive on scene, the media closes in. It's the house. Suspect's truck's here. scours the house. The secondary unit secures the backyard and outbuildings, preventing the suspect from fleeing. Let's walk up to the right of your truck here. The suspect is taken into custody and his weapon confiscated. Is it true that you shot a sea lion, sir? Sir, do you have any response to this? Did you shoot the sea lion in Old Sacramento? Sir, are you sure there's not anything you want to say? Good work on those case, Warden Gamble. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to give you the, uh, the arrest warrant. I think the public seeing how we react and handle a case like this, that we take it very seriously, I, I think it's going to open a lot of eyes and make people a lot more cautious of making a, a mistake like this.